Hey y'all, I know I am backlit. I know that I am not looking my best, but I hope by now y'all don't really expect that because I'm still in the hospital. Um, today is um, the Tuesday the 9th and they have done another assessment on me. Um, I'm still on a wound fat. I am still uh, healing a little bit, but obviously the last minor little surgery that I had went well. Um, my voice is pretty rough because uh, when they do surgery on you, they have to intubate you, and um, sometimes your throat gets sore, and yeah, mine is still sore from the surgery, and they weren't super easy with me. So the uh, sides of my mouth are split and I've had to be real careful about um, what I eat, not eating stuff too salty and not opening my mouth too wide. Um, I miss my makeup. I miss putting a little bit on here and there and kind of having a rough day of um, just I don't want to be in the hospital anymore. Um, Mom went out to get some food because I've kind of been eating the same thing for several days in a row uh, that I've been served from the cafeteria, so she went to go get us some food, and um, I'm, having, I'm being real careful about my diabetes and everything like that. Um, hopefully I'll know a little bit more tomorrow about when I might be getting out of here. Um, I did not reveal this sooner because I did not know, but um, the day that I found out I was having my most recent surgery, um, I found out that I actually had developed necrotizing fasciitis, and that is flesh-eating bacteria. So when I say if I can get it, or if it can be gotten, I can get it. Yeah, let's just believe me from now on. Um, I, we were all shocked because it's, it's not easy to get in the first place. Like, it's not very common. I think there's like 1 in 20,000 cases or 20,000 cases out of all of the U.S. per year. Or the world, not, not just the U.S., the world. So that's crazy that I ended up with that of all things um, but I am grateful that I've had excellent care I am grateful my mom is still able to be here at the hospital with me my needs are so um, specialized that they let her stay with me um, so that they, she can actually direct the nurses about what I need um, just because I have, I'm, I'm a different little animal <laughs> than most people are. And I mean, I did explain that in my Spina Bifida video. So I'm, you know, I'm a special little animal. And so my mom helps take care of me. And she helps stay here with me and keep me calm and uh, all of that stuff. Um, my hemoglobin and my um, my protein and my red blood cell count are low today so I've been a little bit tired um, we're trying to get it back up I've, I'm having an iron infusion at the moment and I'm also drinking a protein shake with every meal so I'm drinking my protein shake while I'm waiting for mom to get back with some food. And I've already had two protein shakes today with my other two meals, which has been awesome. <laughs> I never thought I was going to have to drink protein shakes along with meals in order to get enough protein. Uh, the other night I ate two double cheeseburgers without buns uh, because... I needed the protein and my protein is still low after having eaten 
my camera was sliding. Did we see that? Did we all see that? Um, after having eaten two uh, double cheeseburgers with bacon, cheeseburgers now, my protein was still low. All right, camera. Anyway, I'm not going to be on here for very long because I am not quite with it and I just kind of want to go home today and I'm very tired. Um, but I did want to update everybody and let them know that the second surgery went well. Um, that I am probably going to have a third one before I'm out, let out of here. We don't 100% know. Um, basically, they had to go in and um, clean up where I had the bacteria. And so they're going to either have to close up that area or they're going to have to make some kind of flap um, to cover that area uh, right now because they're talking about doing some reconstructive surgery back there. Um, Y'all, I, I just got a really bad, I just got really, really sick. So um, just keep me in your thoughts and prayers and you know, any positive energy you have. Um, I am getting better, but I'm, you know, still in the hospital, still have very little control over what's going on in my life at the moment. And uh, hopefully I will be out of here soon and can get back to letting you know about um, my makeup use and stuff like that. Um, I am using the uh, Yes to Cucumbers Soothing uh, Face Cream a good bit to um, moisturize. And I have a tube of Calgon lotion um, body cream that I brought to the hospital with me so it's it's going pretty quick um, which I'm happy about because I kind of have myself on like a lotion or smell good like perfume no buy um, it's part of my no buy um, because I don't want to buy any more of any of my trouble categories and that's one of my trouble categories uh, still on the Nova, I still haven't bought anything more than what I updated you guys on last time. And everything is going as well as it can be expected to go. Um, it can go, It's going even better than it can be expected uh, to be right now. And I love y'all, and I hope that y'all are doing better than I am. And I will see y'all in my next video. Hopefully, I will be at home. Alright, I love you all dearly. Bye.